Well, uh, uh, gee, thanks, JB, for the cigar and and the race. Sixty bucks a month. Hey, can I use it? Sure, you can, Mr. Finchley. But how? Huh? Yes. What will you do with those extra dollars? There are lots of things you could do. Bury it in a tin can in the backyard, for instance. But idle money may in time depreciate. Or you could spend it on a couple of nights out a week with the wife. This seems like a lot of fun. But with this kind of life, you'd depreciate. So why not put your money to work? Put my money to work. That's right, Mr. Finchley. You can own a share of American business. There are over 1,200 companies listed on the New York Stock Exchange. Companies which employ more than 11 million people, produce half of all the goods made in America, and pay about half the nation's dividends. Many of these companies have been paying dividends for 25 years or longer. Tycoon. Neither are most of the people who own shares in American business. Three out of four of all share owners are in families which make less than ten thousand dollars a year. The raise was only sixty dollars a month. Well, the monthly investment plan, specifically designed for anyone who wants to invest in common or preferred stocks on a pay-as-you-go basis, you can forty dollars up to one thousand dollars every month or every three months under MIP. So why not the member firm of the New York Stock Exchange? And get some practical advice on how to own a share in American business. And before you invest, investigate. Mr. Finchley, there is a big difference between dealing with a fly-by-night operator and a reputable broker. Please sit down, Mr. Finchley. First, tell me, what are you gonna sell me? Not a thing, Mr. Finchley. As members of the New York Stock Exchange, we are prepared to be of service to you at least. Every day, member brokers buy hundreds of thousands of shares of stock. A doctor in Atlanta wants to buy some stock. A farmer in Spokane wants to sell his stock in the same company to get uh, cash, say, for a new tractor. The Atlanta broker for the buyer and the Spokane broker for the seller speed the orders to their exchange members on the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. When the floor broker representing the buyer bids the price asked by the floor broker representing the seller, a transaction is made. When you sell securities on the New York Stock Exchange, you win cash by the buyer. Every day, millions of dollars of listed securities are bought and sold on the New York Stock Exchange. You can check the price of your stock in a daily newspaper, or by getting the latest market quotation from a member broker like myself. Well, uh, how do I get the facts before I invest? Before you buy stock in a company, you'd want to know, among other things, its record of sales. It's for previous years. What dividends it has paid. And its prospects for the future. Of course, we can't foretell the future. But we can give you many facts and figures to help you select a suitable stock. Well, how about this monthly investment plan? Maybe I'd want to invest only about fifty dollars a month. Yeah, invest. Just think, with sixty bucks a month, I could. Just a moment, sir, if you please. You look like the kind of a pigeon, a uh, uh, man of judgment who knows how to invest his money wisely. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Won't you step into my office, please? Uh, let me give you a hot tip of the strictly confidential. For a limited time only, we are offering to discriminating buyers like yourself a few shares in a world-famous company with mines in Nigeria, Tasmania, Somaliland, and Brooklyn. It's <sighs> Utopium Unlimited. It glows in the dark. Small investment, big profit. As a special favor, I'll let you have 100 shares for only 40 cents a share. That comes to $40. Plus, of course, $20 for putting you onto a sure fire. That's right, Mr. Finchley. All investors should study the facts carefully before they buy any stock. And remember, 
The monthly investment plan is designed especially for people who want to invest as little as $40 or $50, as well as for those who want to invest up to $1,000 every month or every three months. There are many promising investment routes to travel. Many companies whose stocks are listed on the New York Stock Exchange have helped to build our rising standard of living by constantly creating new jobs, services, and products. Therefore, Mr. Finchley and all those who can assume the risk of seeking dividends and profits can put their dollars to work by owning their share of American business through the monthly investment plan.